Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. This is Super Swing Trader. Today we're going to take a look at Forex Pair Pound Auss Aussie on the monthly. This is what we have. We have a an area of supply created up here and another area of supply created right here. and demand zones down here but I'm not going to draw it because I'm not going to draw it because it's that's not our focus right now we're focusing on taking shorts on in this supply zone the weekly this is what we have we have the area this area was taken out and no longer valid but there's this area up here that is valid but then looking at current price action it created this area of supply that i believe was a reaction to this bigger one so if you read price action on the monthly price came up price came up to this level of supply and on the lower time frames it made this wick price came up here and made this wick reacted to this level of supply on the monthly created this wick and then it created this bearish engulfing candle and th and thus this supply zone so create this big supply zone right here. This one is also supply and then reacted nicely. So it formed this one and we'll see if it reacts to it nicely or not. But this is a valid supply zone and on the daily that weekly supply zone is actually this one. So, when it's just one candle, you can draw the whole candle. So this is where I'm looking to go short, but <laughs> it can be kind of scary because, you know, every time frame is up. Every time frame is in an up trend, and now you want to go against the supply zone. So this is a hard one. If you're not familiar with the rules, you may not have the stomach to take it because you're saying, oh, it's an uptrend, you have to buy, buy, buy. But actually, if you're trading the monthly, weekly, daily sequence, you're, you're in a supply zone, you're looking to go short, and this is this created this short supply zone to go short. So daily, this is a good short area to for me to look at shorting. and actually my time frame that I'm going to be shorting is on the weekly and taking just half this candle this is a very wide candle only taking half of that so if price wants to get up there I'm interested in, in shorting it could just you know touch this weekly supply zone and then drop so we'll see We'll see what happens, but that's a potential trade that I'm looking at for next week. And this is it for the analysis. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe by pressing that red button and the bell so you get notified of new videos I release in the future. I make daily swing trading videos on stocks and forex using supply and demand. If you like the video, please hit that thumbs up button. It helps with the YouTube algorithm. I want you to transform your charts into profits and build the life you love.